बेसिक टर्म्स ऑफ फिजिक्स टॉपिक मोशन इन फिजिक्स मोशन इज द फिनोमिन इन विच एन ऑब्जेक्ट चेंजेस इट्स पोजिशन ओवर टाइम इन दिस केस अ रेड कार इज अवर ऑब्जेक्ट एंड इट इज मूविंग फ्रॉम पोजिशन वन टू पोजिशन टू एनीथिंग यू सी अराउंड दैट इज विजिबल विथ मास आर कॉल्ड ऑब्जेक्ट्स मास इज अ मेजरमेंट ऑफ how much matter is in an object like the amount of matter in a certain quantity of water no matter what is the state of it it may be solid liquid or gas matter is anything that occupies space having volume and has mass the si unit that is international systems of units for mass is the kilogram smaller quantities are measured in gram but weight is measured in kgs right in science the weight of an object is the force acting on the object due to gravity when an apple is falling down from a tree its weight is the force acting on it due to the gravity of earth weight is measured in newtons a unit of force mass is the amount of matter in an object whereas weight is the force acting on an object due to the gravity although weight and mass are scientifically distinct quantities the terms are often confused with each other in everyday use the force of gravity exerts on an object determines the object's weight here a spring scale measures weight by seeing how much the object pushes on a spring inside the device the weight changes depending on the gravity earth's gravity is around 9.8 meter per second square whereas moon's gravity is around 1.62 meter per second square so if you weigh around 60 kg on the earth your weight will be around 10 kg on the moon a balance scale indirectly measures mass by comparing an object to a reference the mass of an object will be same irrespective of the location or the gravity on the moon an object would give the same reading as on the earth because the object and references would both become lighter as mentioned earlier in physics motion is the phenomenon in which an object changes its position over time mathematically motion is expressed in terms of displacement distance velocity acceleration speed and time speed is a way of measuring how quickly an object is moving an example of speed is a car driven at 50 km per hour it's a scalar quantity scalars are the quantities that are fully described by a magnitude or a numerical value only whereas vectors are the quantities that are fully described by both a magnitude and a direction velocity is the speed with a direction a car traveling at 50 km per hour is speed a car traveling at 50 km per hour towards east or any other direction is velocity it's a vector quantity the rate at which the velocity of a body changes with time is called acceleration acceleration is also a vector if an object is moving with a constant velocity then its acceleration is zero since the velocity never changes but imagine a car going along at 30 kilometers per hour when we check the speed one second later we find the speed is now 32 kilometer per hour so in that one second the speed increased by 2 kilometers per hour the car is therefore accelerating its speed is increasing by 2 kilometer per hour every second the summary of what we have learned today is motion is the phenomenon in which an object changes its position over time anything you see around that is visible with mass are called objects mass is a measurement of how much matter is in an object matter is anything that occupies space the weight of an object is the force acting on the object due to gravity speed is a way of measuring how quickly an object is moving velocity is the speed with a direction the rate at which the velocity of a body changes with time is called 
acceleration. For more information on the same, please visit our website, themindpalace.in. The link is provided in the description below. Mind Palace. If you like this video, do like, share, and subscribe.